Hi everybody, I'm Jim. And I'm Rich. And we're playing Resident Rise. That's what they tell me. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to cook up some more uh, objects here. And we're going to get into my energetic infuser, which I didn't get a chance to. Wait, where do you go? Uh, I'm in my workshop. No, my archer. I step into the castle, I come back out, and he's gone. What the heck? Have you considered that they may not like you? I mean, yeah, that's possible. It's also possibly a bug. I shall have to do research after this episode. Alright, so I got a basic machine frame. So I was going to set up more farms and stuff. Um, and we're going to need... Instead, I think I'm going to go breed some animals inside. Copper, silver... Actually, I need to go do something. And gold. I need to go catch a couple chickens. I wonder if it's because I'm not giving him a name, he's despawning. That seems weird. It does. Like, that seems unlikely. I'm gonna have to do some research. Uh, and while I'm waiting on that, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. let's... Chicken! Make some bronze, because that's what we're gonna need for... Uh, the... Carpentry stuff. Bronze, 24 bronze. So we are going to need a carpenter, an analyzer, and a centrifuge. Sounds like a lot of work. Kind of, yeah. So after having looked at the space outside near oh, the castle, oh, I have to cook the bronze. Um, right I think I'm manually making a tree farm area and expanding the fence line. Oh, yeah. It seems that the you know desert where we are is right near the edge of it. Yes, yes, it is. I don't really feel like creating a bridge across the river. It seems like a cool idea. I'm lazy like that, though. It's true, you are. Alright, so let's get the uh, reception coil for our energetic infuser, and let's also start looking at what we need to make a jetpack. The tier 1 jetpack, the leadstone jetpack. We need a bunch of lead ingots. I believe we have a whole bunch. I'm a bit of a monster. I kind of want to name my uh, little animal farm there, the Love Shack. That's super weird. Mm -hmm. Like, really super weird. Well, I happened to be looking at it as the song was going through my head. Uh-huh. Oh, we also need copper. Let's we have that. No, we need sulfur. Do we have any sulfur? Um, no idea. Fair. You know a way to find out? I can Go check the storage, storage system. system. If it's not in there, that means Jim hasn't gone and organized the chests, and he can look through them himself. Hint, I didn't find the any one? in the storage system. Okay, thank you for looking at the storage system. That's sort of what I was looking for here. Mostly, I don't think Sulphur's a base Minecraft mod. Yeah. So, so far I've got Scooter breeding and killing animals for me. 
And he's doing a good job. He's also growing wheat for me. I'm wondering if I should set him up to do fishing for me as well. That seems wise, given that fishing completely infuriates you. I have to go and find literally a single piece of sulfur for my jetpack. That's yellow right. That's more yellow right. I'm pretty sure that sulfur occurs down near the bottom. You know where else you can find sulfur? Where? The nether. Pretty sure that sulfur occurs down near the <laughs> bottom. And actually, while we're here, we're going to move the pump rig. Okay, so the other thing I want to get done is I need a warehouse. Now the scooter is running my farm for me. Alright, so let's throw some dirt out here. Just to... Oh. And we'll put the pump over it. Got the first part about making sure I'm going to have a warehouse to do all this stuff. Just to make sure mm -hmm. I can... Make it a large bounce upgrade, so a 16 by 16 multi-block warehouse. What does it? What does the warehouse do? Uh, it allows my I villagers mean, to uh, store stuff. They'll organize please. it automatically for me. I was reading somewhere. I think there's mailboxes in this game that can work across dimensions. Neat. Oh yeah, sulfur is from thermal foundation and railcraft, so that's why. Uh... Yeah, no, I didn't think we'd have any storage system. I was mostly wondering if I had found some already somewhere. No, oh, but apparently, if you pulverize a blaze rod, you can get four blaze powder and a fifty percent chance of sulfur. Good translation, Jim. Why don't you go to the Nether and fight shit that flies when you can't fly? Jim, why don't you look in our handy dandy storage system that has thirty-two blaze rods? Fair. Is it specifically a pulverizer? Yes. We don't have one of those either. Well, whose fault's that? We have a sag mill! Well, okay, let me look up sulfur again and see if it'll work in the sag mill. <laughs> I'm just hunting down in the ravine. Pulverizing Are you opening chests? Huh? Oh, no! I know what I'm hearing. There's a mimic up there. Yeah, the sag mill will work too, but I think you need some flint or a dark steel ball in it. Yeah, I can put some flint in it. But I was kind of hopeful that I would just find some. I think the ore is pretty much replaced by the yellowite, though. Shouldn't be. From big reactors. I am 100% not finding any. Oh wow, with uh, it looks like... Okay, maybe it's just this mod is just not telling me where they are. Hmm? Oh, sometimes uh, NEI will let you know what Y levels to search through for it. Ah, seems super useful. Yeah, it's not in this case. Well. Can't win them all. Can I find my way back to the mine shaft? Probably not. Probably not, you're not wrong. There we are. Yeah, I know what it looks like. It looks kind of like gold and yellowite. And yellowite, that's the problem. is, And, and there's so much yellowite down here. Alright, so we're going to wall that up. Like I said, we're not going to deal with that right now. Got more yellowite. I was doing something and you distracted me. Oh, 100% I did. Warehouse, that's right. Warehouse control block. Two chests, planks, paper. Right. I'll grab some flint and some blaze rods and see if I can't grind them up. Thank you, Rich. Maybe check the chests down here. 
on the off chance that they have some. No, it looks like the turtles didn't find any either. Turtle crew, you've let me down. Now. I love you anyway, but. Where should I put this warehouse? Because I'm a monster, and I'm doing a 16 by 16, which is a really dumb idea. That doesn't sound, it doesn't sound like you're a monster. That sounds stupid. Like, it sounds like, like, I don't know why that's stupid. I'm just thinking, you how, seem to think why would I need that much storage space out here? Now, worst comes to worst, I can knock some stuff room out and uh, change the bounds. Ooh, right, didn't want to go that far. And a couple more. Friends, I don't think this is working. we will live in disappointment. So you know what I'm going to do before I grind up a bunch of... Uh... I mean, you think my archers have just gone invisible. That seems weird. Well, I'm seeing Why? a whole bunch of arrows in the ground out here. Hmm. That does sound weird. No, they didn't. Did they run inside and go up onto the battlements? Play up on the walls? That's a good question. Towers? I mean, now that I think about it, that's actually a really good place. I was hoping that maybe we'd have some sulfur in our treasure room. I'm guessing uh, we don't. No, we don't. No? They're not up was... there. I have no idea what happened to them. It's weirding me out, to be honest. That is a little weird. Alright. Blaze rods. Let's grab like eight of them. Now we're gonna need flint, you said? That's what it looked like. Rhetorical question, I mean. Yay, I'm collecting eggs. Hopefully feathers too. Uh, what's I doing? Right, right, right. Working on the warehouse some more. I'm also gonna need to make a courier and hope he doesn't vanish. I need a. I mean, we're not doing small warehouse storage blocks. But I'm gonna need a warehouse interface first. Just another chest, another paper. And more planks. I'm seeing a theme developing here. The deep need for planks? Yeah. Too bad we don't have a tree farm. I was going to say, and you wondered why I recommend we have a large tree farm. What is a wonderful building material? Stone. Stone is also a wonderful building material. Oh, you said wood is. I thought you asked what is. Um, okay, so let's put the flint in here, let's put the blaze rods in here, let's see what we can do. Okay. 
Sulfur! Yay! Yay! Yay indeed. I just imagine you doing like the, um... Like Kermit the Frog, yay! Uh, yeah. Dude, I like jetpacks. Yeah, you seem to be afraid to go anywhere without them. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. However, I'm gonna need a lot of copper, so let's get the energetic infuser done first. Which means let's grab those silver bars of the chest. I need a bunch more of that. Let's throw that in the furnace for now. So Witchery seems to have a scroll called Torment. That's a word. Yeah. I don't recommend concerning yourself with it. Well, not yet. I'll probably eventually need more warehouse interfaces, but for now, let's get some large warehouse storage. Hmm. Chests, planks, iron. We should have lots of iron, right? We should. Looks that way. Alright, we now have an energetic infuser. I'm going to pop this next to my... Um, He's currently storing up to 4 million RF. So now, when we build a jetpack, we can charge it. I forgot how involved the basic jetpack is. You need steam dynamos, which means you need 22 pieces of copper per... Could I some more? This heavy weapons guy would say. I'm like, I'm not sure where we're going with that, but okay. I'm gonna come over and steal some leather. And also some copper. The problem with using Ender IO for a lot of stuff is I forget how hungry other mods are for copper and tin. So, 13,824 items of storage. Currently? In my warehouse, yeah. That's how much I can store. Oh, cool. Scooter, have you got any support jobs yet? No, of course not. Finding more arrows. Go hide these from Jim, and then I think I'm gonna have to go and find and kill some chickens and pigs. Oh, your leather's in your warehouse now, isn't it? Not yet. Okay. Look in the storage some. system. <laughs> How many times do I have to say this, Jim? I didn't realize you you were manually running your leather to the storage system. We had leather in there before we had to make the change. You'd know this if you paid attention. I'd know this if I cared about the storage system. You will once it gets back up to remote access. Yes, then I will. That's true. You know to that get it back up to remote I'm access? I'm gonna do it. When you get around to doing it. Ah. Uh. I was doing something. Oh, right, I need to I go. I feel like it. a hen pecked engineer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, like, it is the weirdest, like, Star Trek roommate conversation where you're like, I noticed that the storage system isn't remote access like it was. Um, did you. <laughs> oh, man. 
All right, now I have lots of copper. Just you wait. I'll get my village up and running. Then I'll go back to my wizardry bullshit, and then you'll see Good. what else. I'll, I'll launch forward to it. Well, I wish I could launch fireballs from the top of my tower down at you. Oh, I need some more silver too. I need to set up, find a place to create a blood altar. All right. You'll donate to the cause, right? Sorry, what? You donate blood to the blood altar. Uh, no. No, actually, I 100% won't. Why not? Um, because I'm not super into blood altars. They'll be super into you. Not unless they chase me. All I need you to do is go over there and just take the knife and stab yourself a few times. I don't... I'm not going to do that. That... That doesn't seem like a thing I would want to do. I'm sure it'll be fine. I don't think that's true. Hey, we got a spider spawner over by where we were set up before. At least I think it's a spider spawner because there's a crap ton of cobwebs around it. That seems weird. And a modest hive. Don't well, leave the hive. Now we can make the thrusters, right? What I find amusing is this started out as you making stuff for bees. No, 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 no. Jetpack, jetpack was always on the list. There was no point at which jetpack was not on the list. I mean, from what I understand, in basic Minecraft, jetpack is on your list, and you can't even get it there. Mm-hmm. getting very uncomfortable. No. No, it isn't. It's going to be so wonderful. In fact, it's going to be so wonderful. So let's start looking at the next level. Oh, we're going to need some dynamos for that. No, we're not getting there anytime soon. Go get your bees. No, 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 no. We're so close. I mean, before you go for the next level. Do it. Yes. Wow, um, are you sure your channel has the proper rating for this conversation? Creepy Jim. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Besides, I mean, who wouldn't be a little creepy? I mean, I think you're starting to get into the creepier than my uh, evilness creepy. You monster! <laughs> I descend! You sure you want to? And then I fly! I better not wind up dead. And now I think that what I thought was an invisible archer was you shooting at me from the battlements. No, I would never do that. Yeah, it was totally me. 
hundred percent me. I was, I was standing at the edge of my workshop trying to ace you with an arrow from, from my battlements. Oh. <laughs> Send help.